and turns into gum. Hello, I'm Ken from KVD Productions TV. Welcome back to the Ken Domic product review just for you. Because it was Halloween yesterday, I went up to the candy shop and was gonna buy some Halloween candy that I like, and there's like a bonus to this video, by the way. And I asked her, so what are the top 10 selling candies you guys sell out of your shop and they sell worldwide. You can actually order online from them. And so she picked out the top 10 things. Let us know in the comments below, which is your favorite. And also try and guess before the end of the video, which is the number one sold item at the candy shop. All right guys, so I'm just gonna go through them really quick so you guys get an idea. This is called Cuckoo, Laffy Taffy, Gold Mine, Sour Keys, Razzles, Lifesavers Butter Rum, Macintosh Taffy, Love Hearts, Popeye Sticks. They used to be called Popeye Cigarettes, and then they thought that was a bad idea, teaching kids to smoke. Yeah, bad idea. Thrills Gum. So I'm gonna go from 10 all the way up to number one. Again, try to leave a comment in the comment section below as to what you think is number one. Here we go. Number 10 is Razzles. I've never had a Razzle before, so today is the day. It smells like berries. So we've got different colors in there. Let's do a couple. They look like dog treats. Sorry, Sam, but they do. They look like dog treats. I do remember eating these when I was a kid. It's like powder. <coughs> it turns into gum. That's a great flavor. Lime, raspberry, grape, orange, and berry. Blueberry. I could totally see people choking on this. Just like I did. It starts off very flavorful, but slowly starts to turn back into the gum. And it's like a hard to chew type gum. This is not a gum you'd want to chew for a very long time. Let's move on. All right, next up, Laffy Taffy. I think I kind of remember this. So it looks like bubble gum. Okay, let's rip off a piece. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is Laffy Taffy. Wow. Wow. Here we go. Mmm. Strawberry. I remember eating this one from when I was a kid. And it is really good. The, the flavor of the um, strawberry is nice as opposed to some of the other artificially flavored strawberry things. It says no artificial flavors. That's probably why, right there. Number eight on our list is a Macintosh toffee. So it used to come in a box, if you remember. And uh, my my grandfather, I remember, had like a little hammer, and then you'd smack it, and uh, it would break. So I'm gonna try and break it. Oh, it broke all right. It scared the dog too. Sorry, Sam. I broke off a little bit of the taffy there or toffee. It's a little bit different from the other stuff. That's really stringy, and this is a much harder type toffee. Mmm, very buttery. No added artificial flavors or colors. This toffee is actually made of like just butter and sugar, and that's why it tastes so good. Again, I haven't had that in a very long time, so I'm glad I had it again today. Number seven on our list is the Sour Keys, or Sour Soothers. They're kind of like a very chewy gummy bear, but uh, different flavors, as you can see, all different colors and flavors. And then it's coated with sour sugar and whatever they put on that. Let's do it. Mmm. Haven't had these in a long time, yeah. Once you get to the sugary sour part, the gummy part is very sweet, chewy, and delicious. Number six on our list is Love Hearts. I definitely remember eating these as a kid. Big love. Sour. It almost has that like sizzling pop rocks effect in your mouth. It almost tastes like they put baking powder in it or something, because it fizzes in your mouth. Sorry, I'm really sour. It's all powdery now. And it's fizzing. No, I'm not kidding. <laughs> Number five on our list is gold mine gum. It's supposed to be bubble gum, but uh, I remember it not being that great. 
and uh, let's get that sticker off. I just remember like you, it was cool because it was like gold and uh, there you go, it's just yellow. It's not as gold looking as you think it should be. But uh, I just remember putting it back into the bag and then you just take pieces at a time. But it's, I just remember the, the gum part not lasting very long, uh, kind of like the, the razzles. So let's put a bunch in my, in my mouth here. Gold mine gum. I don't think you can even blow bubbles with it. Mm -mm. Very sweet. It has like the double bubble texture to it once you get it going. But again, it started off like a candy. Right to gum. Let's see if I can blow a bubble. There you go, it really is bubble gum. Number four on the list, and I can't believe it's even on the list, is Thrills Gum. It does taste like soap, people. And I don't like the taste of soap. Oh, I'm gonna do two. Here we go. Oh, it's like lavender soap. People like it. I'm not sure if it's a gag gift that you want to give to somebody, but it is one of the nastiest candies you'd ever want to try. Number three on our list is Cuckoo Taffy. I remember this as a kid. Uh, they changed the recipe. I believe the original company went bankrupt or they just stopped selling it or whatever. And uh, so they, they went bankrupt and then somebody else bought it. I guess Cuckoo bought it. And uh, let me know if I'm right or wrong, but it comes in three Neapolitan flavors, so strawberry, vanilla, and chocolate. I should just grab a huge chunk. Mmm. Kind of dissolves in your mouth. Again, uh, the, the flavor has changed. Whatever recipe they used to use back in the day was way better, or maybe my taste buds are changed, but uh, that's not bad. But again, back in the day, it tasted way better. Did any of you guys pick either one of these as the number one? Well, this is number one. This is number two. One of my favorite all-time lifesavers, butter rum. Uh, I, I think I bought a roll of this last summer just to show my kids. Uh, again, they, they, they actually thought, because it says the word rum on it, that there's alcohol in it, but there is not alcohol in it. There we go. Just make sure there's no paper on it. Butter rum, best tasting lifesaver on the planet. Mm. If you get a chance, buy some lifesavers butter rum, because these things are dynamite. When you're munching on it, like I just did, it does have kind of a rum flavor, but more like an eggnog with nutmeg and a hint of rum in it. That's the flavor you get, and it is just wonderful. All right, number one on the list for the candy shop that they sell, and it's Popeye Sticks, AKA Popeye Cigarettes. I wonder if they actually, I haven't bought these in a very long time. They even, back in the day, they used to be like a, an end that was red, and the kids would be walking around, hey man, how's it going? And uh, that was a bad idea, whoever, whoever thought of that. Popeye Cigarettes, let's teach the kids to smoke. So they're just little candy sticks. Let me cleanse the palate. As you can hear, very crunchy. It's just like a sugar stick. A candied sugared stick. Hmm. Number one ingredient, sugar, cornstarch, glucose syrup, artificial flavors. It says tasty candy sticks. No, if there were butter rum candy sticks, then there'd be tasty sticks. All right, guys, I hope you did really well on your guessing on this video, but here is my number one candy for Halloween, and it is these taffies. And there was a couple. There's like ones that are darker than the other ones. I like, I prefer the lighter kind. It says original Halloween kiss, and it is a taffy and uh, it could pull your fillings right out. It can. I believe they only sell these during Halloween, but again, that was my favorite thing. And again, this will pull out fillings. Are you ready? Here we go. Hmm. 
nice and sweet. Has a molasses. It's like molasses and sugar and butter. Let me know in the comments below if you still buy these, if you remember them as a kid. These ones not as, as stringy, like you used to be able to grab it and pull it all apart like that. These ones are kind of like, I don't know, it's just not, not a, it's like almost like a cookie dough It's coming apart like that. Mmm. Still tastes great. All right, guys, thank you very much for stopping by my channel and checking out the top 10 candies sold at the candy shop. If you enjoyed this top 10 video and you want to see more, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. But if you want to show your support for this video, give it a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time on another Kendomic product review top 10. Kendomic out. Cheers. Oh my gosh, I can't even get into them. I should have brought a freaking knife or something. I'm not gonna be defeated by a candy wrapper.